Hi, my name's Narelle. And my name's Tiernan. And welcome to, to the, the News Plug. Plug. In headlines, it's been a wrap been found in KFC in central London in broad daylight. Customers are in outrage and some have even boycotted. In other news, scientists have said that phones can cause cancer and illnesses in some children. Maybe you have phone less. In big headlines today, Apple are afraid to shut down due to controversy due to being hacked. We're handing over to Fatima now to see what she says on the matter. Hello, today we're here at the Apple headquarters to ask Dan Gilbert what he has to say about the Apple shutdown. Last week, Matthew McGregor hacked into the Apple server causing many complications, such as apps not working like Snapchat, FaceTime and Instagram. Hello, so um, what do you have to say about the Apple shutdown? Well, the situation we have now is there is a, a young man by the name of David McGregor who has managed to hack into our servers, leaked a lot of data at the minute, so we've had to restrict access and literally block you know certain apps such as instagram um, facetime um, snapchat the usual stuff that most young people do we've had to block it because this is quite a significant data breach it is totally unacceptable and that is what we've had to do so what are apple going to do about this well the first thing we are obviously going to do is to make sure we do not lose our customers so we're going to have to offer them some sort of compensation now, what the compensation, what form the compensation will take, I don't really know. But all I know is it will probably be financial, as in we give them some money back. Just to say thank you for them bearing with us in this difficult time. And what are Apple's plans for the future so this doesn't happen again? We are obviously going to need to look at our security functions and features, and we are going to need to tighten a lot of things. Unfortunately, it will also mean that customers will need to adjust the way that they do things because you will find that all of a sudden to create a password on an Apple device, the password will be asked to be lengthier or much more stronger because it is weak passwords that has caused this in the first place. And we came to Chestnut Grove to see what the teachers and students think. I'm really happy to be honest. I think that social media has just got absolutely out of control. People are constantly using their phones. They're not talking to each other anymore. I'm just really happy that this has happened. I know I might be in the minority, but I really think it will improve communication. Well, I don't personally own any Apple products or anything like that, so um, I, I wouldn't notice. Um, I'd be really disappointed that Apple got shut down as the fact that I own loads of Apple devices. I use them on a daily and also I can't revise without them and yeah, I'd just be disappointed. And that's what they think. Back to you, Nero. What am I going to do with Apple shutting down? I just got my new iPhone 10. What am I going to do about, my, what am I going to do about this? Man, I, life ain't all about iPhones. Well, I just spent one grand on my new phone. That's too much money, man. <sighs> You've heard from us, now we want to hear from you. Comment on our website or follow up our socials. But for now, peace. Why